make places. ஒருத்தர்ம <laughs> 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 Okay. Uh Why not? Let's go. Thank you so much. So you will translate directly? Yep. Namaskaram. Namaskara. Vanakkam. Vanakkam. Andariki. Andariki. Vandanam. Vandanam. Ellarigu. Ellarigu. Namaskara. Namaskara. Nanna jate. Nanna jate. Nanna jate. Nintirva. ನಿಂತಿರುವಾಲ್ ಹುಡುಗಿ ಉದುಂಕಿ ತುಂಬಾ ತುಂಬಾ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದಾಳೆ ಸೇ ಅಗೇನ್ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದಾಳೆ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದಾಳೆ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಸೋ ವೆರಿ ಮಚ್ ನೌ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ನೋ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಸೇಡ್ ಯಾ ಯು ಗುಡ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಯು ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸೇ ದ ಲೇಡಿ ಹೂ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಟು ಯು ಇಸ್ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ಓಕೆ ಓಕೆ ಸರ್ thank you for being such a sport and now the entire audience are waiting to hear from you so request you to kindly address us okay thank you round of applause ladies and gentlemen i will uh, take the risk of duplicate what ravinder already said a few minutes ago and what i want to say is that i'm happy 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 to be here with you today it has been uh, three long years we could not organize any kind of this meeting we cannot see each other even and we have been working most of the time in remote these years have been really difficult but we all together with you our friends our partner we managed this difficult period we survived and we won and here we are after 3 years stronger than before I think it has been hard for everybody of us. We have learned a lot of a lot of lessons during this period. But this period has been somehow successful. We have been shown to be flexible, reactive, resilient, and even our brand and our market share have increased visibility and success. And this only thanks to you all. because you have been doing the job on the field thank you now as a chairman i will not talk about prices discounts other things there are people which are much better than me in doing this i would like to address a bit the future of our group the future of our activity in cement in india and i will start with three points the three points in reverse order of importance are digital transformation cyber security and environmental transformation reverse order i said so i will continue like this during uh, the last uh, five years at least we can group but not only realize that there are challenges for the future which cannot escape anymore i remember for example 10 years ago we had an internal meeting on co2 emissions most of us we were skeptical about the need for the industry to do something to reduce the co2 emissions we were thinking that it was just an alarm by some scientist which we should not follow which we should not take that much seriously because we are thinking that co2 is uh, 
something that we could not escape, that we have to generate to produce cement, and that in any case, by history, all the resources during the history of humanity have been used till the last drop, and then after only switching to other solutions. So 10 years ago, the conclusion of this internal meeting was, okay, maybe CO2 is responsible for uh, climate changes, but we are not sure. In this moment, we don't have alternatives. Let's wait and see. Things have changed. Nowadays, not only Vika Group, but the full world, the full industry in the world, not only cement, but every industry, has realized that CO2 is a big issue. And in the past years, things became more and more serious, and the alarm which has been raised by the scientists seems to be concrete, solid, and actually real. So, VK, but not only VK, as I said, started thinking seriously on which kind of commitment to take. And the commitment that we took is to reduce by 30% our CO2 emission by 2030, which is in eight years from now, is not another century, and to reduce to zero in 2050. Even we don't know exactly how we will reduce to zero in 2050, but we have started working on that. Just for your uh, reminder, I would like to, to tell that uh, many countries, or I would say all countries in the world, they have committed to reduce CO2 emissions. Some of them, they have accepted the zero emission for 2050. Some others, like India, they have postponed this target to 2070 for very good reasons. Reasons are that the country is fast developing. Reasons are that the infrastructure needs to be improved. So India believes that uh, the country needs 20 more years than the rest of the world to achieve this result of zero emission in 2070. India is not the only one. Some other big countries like China, they are committing for the same date, which is 20 years after the majority of the other countries. This is not the point. In any case, Vika Group works not only in India, and we decide to commit for 2050, and especially for 2030, which I say is eight years from now, and for which we have set up a target which is uh, challenging, but feasible. 30% reduction in our CO2 emissions. So let's talk about CO2 emissions. Most of you, you know that the CO2 generated by the industry in general, by the cement industry, creates some uh, modification in the climate and contributes to rising up the temperatures every year. According to the scientists, the possible increase in temperature, even in the range of one or two degrees, can have a dramatic effect on the planet in terms of life, sustainability, wellness for human being, for the economy, for the nature. So let's go to our industry, cement. Cement industry produces, uh, I would say, a lot of CO2. At the base, there is CO2 produced during the process when we transform limestone in clinker. You should know that uh, almost 30% of the weight of the limestone is converted into CO2 during the process, which means a plant like uh, Kalburgi and Barati together, producing 8 million tons of cement per year. In this moment, they emit roughly, I would say, more than 3 million tons 
almost 4 million tons of CO2.